dear viewers of Team Power, this is Team TV program. I'm your host, Irfan Fasrat. Let's now get started with our today's episode and we will come back. Have a nice day. Case Western Reserve University is one of the top-ranked schools and the best research universities in the U.S., which is located in Cleveland, Ohio. Many scholars and experts from the university are strongly connecting with STEM Power in STEM Endeavor partnerships at various levels. The partnership, among many others, includes curriculum development, experience sharing, and many more. Recently, an Ethiopian student from the university has come to share his experience with many students in different parts of Ethiopia. Who is the student and what did he share? The following episode has an answer. My name is Zemmene Sisai. I am a graduate student at Case, University of Case Western Reserve and I am studying my master's and my research focus area is technology development for converting of natural resources to value-added products. I received my Bachelor of Science in Chemical Engineering from Addis Ababa University. The environment is conducted for my study and just I am very interested in just to, to be student at Case Western Reserve University. After I accomplished the first year of my studying, just I was discussed with my professor uh, to have a project to do with STEM power and as well as I am doing my research, my master's research and I came back to Ethiopia when I am planning to come back to Ethiopia. Just I was thinking about my high school, just it's in the Lumena town, it's far from Addis, so the students there are, have not an opportunity to see laboratory as well as just to doing experiment. So I, I discussed with my professor. My professor is called Daniel Lux. So just uh, he is allowed to me just to have a chemical micro factory kits to do laboratory workshop in the Lumen High School. And in the Lumen High School, just uh, 160 students were participated in the program of chemical engineering lab workshop for two weeks and uh, these 160 students are grouped, were grouped in 16 groups. These students are uh, top six students from each class and they, do, they did uh, two laboratory that's uh, soap production from cooking oil and as well oil production from oil seed. So the time was very amazing. The students were so uh, the theoretical part of just doing of soap as well as making of oil from oil seed and they integrated with their chemistry as well as their physics, math mathematics and biology to do these experiments. So first we seen together the laboratory, then after the students from each group, it's 16 groups, so they compete they compute uh, computed with uh, just to develop the best product of soap and value added soap that is they are creating their own coloring agent as well as their own order some groups are also producing and developing soap that is used for a medical purposes uh, so after they are computed uh, after the competition, one group is winner, uh, the winner, and just it's awarded with the 10 students in, the, in that group. That was very amazing time. The school management was also very happy, and they thanks to Case Western Reserve Univers University as well as STEM Power Ethiopia uh, and just uh, I am studying my, uh, my master's in chemical engineering. Chemical engineering have a great benefit like for the developing country like Ethiopia. Uh, just chemical engineering or uh, chemical micro factory stage that is for example just in pharmaceuticals to improving health care to producing clean energy uh, as well as in 
uh, producing of detergents, cements. When you see Ethiopia is just the economy of Ethiopia is based on agriculture, so we have a lot of natural resources. So chemical engineering have a great benefit to be just uh, to get the countries from natural resource of this integration helps to develop new things to create new technology or to improve ex existing technology for the country of Ethi like Ethiopia so it have a lot of benefits then in the final uh, just I would like to thanks for STEM Power Ethiopia uh, to have uh, just to give the Ethiopian students as well for specifically on high school and uh, for primary students to make an awareness about engineering and to uh, to have the chance to to improve their creativity for Ethiopian students as well as I would like to thanks for Case Western Reserve University uh, to have my school to this great opportunity, this golden chance. <laughs> Dear viewers, it's our hope that you get something informative and educated from our episode today. Uh, and don't forget to watch uh, any videos our YouTube channel, Steam Power Ethiopia. Next week we will meet. I'm your host, Efrata Strat. Have a nice day.